Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Multinational smartphone companies like Microsoft and Nokia have successfully previously reached respectable heights. However, as time passed, people looked up to something new and better. Finally, the era of Nokia ended and the market was taken over by Samsung. However, the scene might change soon. Well, stick around, cause we are doing comparison between Tesla phone and Samsung Galaxy S22. Without further ado, let's begin. The talk of the hour is the launch of the Tesla Model Pi. This model is rumored to be one of the best smartphone models witnessed up to date. However, there's been no official press release about its specifications, but the possibility cannot be neglected when Elon Musk himself is the brain behind it. The launch date of either product has not been officiated as of now, but certain sources say that both of them are due to hit the markets in the upcoming year. Here are some of the distinguishing features that would make this Tesla Pi stand out from the crowd. Firstly, let's look at the network connectivity that Musk is aiming to provide with this new Pi phone. According to the latest reports, the Tesla Pi is supposed to come with a built-in Starlink network access. The satellite company operated by SpaceX, owned by Musk himself, thereby the phone will have its network, will be able to download at speeds of 210 megabytes per second at any corner of the Earth without any internet traffic. In contrast, Samsung depends on other internet providers for connectivity. Most cell phone network operators only work within a particular region with commendable speed. Surely they could try to build their satellite. The constellation that would require them to undergo the process of designing and launching the satellite into the low Earth orbit, something Musk has acquired years ago. Even if Samsung succeeds in building a space company, launching a satellite successfully will require around a half a century. Another fair factor of comparison between the two phones is the manufacturing process. Samsung being a manufacturing company makes most of its parts by itself, but buys chipsets for some of its phones from Qualcomm. For phones sold in countries that use CDMA networks. They also use Sony camera parts in part of their phones. Samsung also assembles its phones in their factories in South Korea, Vietnam, and India. This patient, the vertical integration strategy of manufacturing components has borne fruit for Samsung in the late 2000s. We have no proper details about the assembling of the Tesla phone, but Musk continues with his conventional prototype of in-house production. This ensures the high quality of every single part and flawless assembly of the handset. It might delay the final release of the products in the market, but ensures quality. However, with the leadership of Musk, the task isn't impossible. Now, let's compare the two models based on the hardware features as per the latest update, the Tesla phone would come with an operating system of Android 12 and consist of a microchip design exclusively by Tesla. It is rumored to have a high-speed processor of 3.2 GHz and its battery is at 4,950 mAh. The Pi will be designed to charge itself with solar power. This facility has two benefits. First, it is economical, and second, it will save us from the trouble of finding an adapter cable and a socket every time our phone runs out of charge. On the other hand, Samsung S22 is supposed to work with Android 11, and 845 Snapdragon processors are the processor of this phone, is 2.9 GHz slower than the expected Pi charges through a port of 45 watts or wirelessly, and has a battery capacity of 5,000 milliamps per hour. This is greater than that of the Tesla model, however, we generally hear complaints from Samsung users regarding the decreasing battery life after a certain period. Well, there is something more essential for certain customers, the camera. Both the cell phones are seen with four back cameras and their arrangement significantly resembles each other. The Tesla Model Pi has the main wide length of 108 megapixels, a 50 megapixel periscopic lens, a 50 megapixel ultra wide lens, and a 5 megapixel micro lens. The selfie camera is rumored to be a 48 megapixel accompanied by a recording quality of 4K at the rate of 60 frames per second. It gives a brilliant resolution of 1344 by 2722. The speculator suggests that the cameras of the Tesla Pi will be so powerful that they'll be able to capture images of the Milky Way. On the contrary, Samsung Galaxy 22 has a better resolution of 1440 by 3200, but the camera quality is seriously compromised. 
It consists of a 108 megapixel main wide lens, a 12 megapixel periscopic lens, a 12 megapixel telephoto lens, and a 12 megapixel ultra wide lens. The selfie camera has a capacity of 40 megapixels, or the video recording quality of 8K at 24 frames per second. If you're enjoying the video, then make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos just like this. If you are concerned about the storage capacity of your handsets, these gadgets will excite you. The Tesla Pi comes with an expanded memory range of 12 to 16 gigabytes of RAM and 256 to 512 gigabytes of internal capacity. On the other hand, Samsung Galaxy S22 has 12 gigabytes of RAM and 512 gigabytes of internal storage. Although Samsung releases different variants of a particular model with different storages, this one is restricted to the given limit as per the latest reports. The Tesla Pi is estimated to have flash storage for 2 terabytes to accommodate the user's data. However, a perfect phone is nothing without a gorgeous exterior. As seen in the alleged photos of the Samsung Galaxy S22, the back flaunts a contour cut camera that's less pronounced. The contour contrasts the traditional Samsung model and is considered a good upgrade. In addition, it has a matte black with a flatter design. Some critics have pointed out its striking resemblance to the Samsung Galaxy Note phablet. However, the Tesla Pi, the phone is not monochrome. The cover contains a secret element that changes its shades corresponding to the intensity of sunlight. If this feature works accordingly, it would be the most stunning smartphone in history. Although it sounds nearly impossible, Tesla's brilliance is trustworthy. Moreover, the Tesla Pi phone is supposed to have exclusive Neuralink integration. Neuralink is Elon Musk's brainchild that works on developing ultra-high bandwidth machine interfaces to link human brains to computers. Reports claim that the Model Pi will directly connect to the user's brain and work accordingly, which means we don't even have to type a text to work on the handset. This smartphone will allow customers to mine cryptocurrency. Marscoin users are rumored to be able to use it on Mars, while the phone works as their crypto wallet. Samsung Galaxy S22, on the other hand, has no advanced technologies. It has no way of interlinking our brainwaves with our smartphones. The technology is exclusively limited to Tesla users. Tesla branding means the Pi would be a natural accessory to a Tesla car. By making cars and phones simultaneously, Tesla would be able to create a seamless interface between the two and make the cars truly automatic. You can also control and charge robot taxis soon. Samsung Galaxy 22 lacks this incredible feature as well. No matter how much the company boasts of futuristic features, it can never match the tech giant's brainchild. Musk once said in an interview that he would like to die on Mars. His eagerness reflects in this project. This smartphone will become a huge step towards colonizing the red planet. So guys, let me know down in the comments section below, which one do you personally like? For more interesting content, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Have a nice day and I will see you in the next video!